Hey everybody, the Banga is here, yet to give you another Let's Play. I am putting off on Mega Man 6, at least for the time being, to give you Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves. If you remember the book and you remember the movie, then you're going to enjoy this. So tune in! It's gonna be fun. Jerusalem, 1194 AD. Third year of the Third Crusade. Wow, they got three crusades already? Man, they're putting out pretty fast. Arab Dungeon Sunset. And here you are inside a prison there with all the same brown drab background. Oh, I'll talk to the prisoner. Help me Robin. Help me Robin there, mate. Can't hold out any longer. Oh, my god. Yeah, he looks like he's suffering pretty bad there. Hung up in stocks. Looks like he's having an orgasm or something. Like, jeez, I mean, you're not that bad, are you? Quiet there, Englishman, or your turn will be twice as long! Yeah, I hate for that guard to be working for the RCMP or the Los Angeles Police Force, because he doesn't seem to notice that there's a sword laying there in the corner, right behind him, completely unattended to. Like, this is the kind of situation retarded people can find themselves in. Like, hey, Robin, there, can you give me that sword? Okay. <laughs> Hey, look at that, mister. Oh, sorry, I made you blow up there for no reason. Oh, we're free at last then. Not unless we get out of here, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah you, you lead the way. I'll try to keep up my knickers a bit slower these days. Peter has joined Robin's band. Yeah, so there's the uh, dead body there looking to the right for some reason. I wonder how you're supposed to get out, like, huh, the door is locked. Yeah, funny how Peter would tell me that let's get out of here, but he has no way to unlock the door, like, hello, am I supposed to beat up the door, or just slash at it, or, huh, oh, there's a menu here, I guess I'm supposed to, uh, look, maybe, Robin Hood is an air prison, no shit! And he sees nothing of interest except a sword that was unattended and a corpse looking to the right. But maybe I'll try searching, you know. Finds a hidden door key. Okay, why would a door key just be held by some guardsman? He would hold on to the key, but he wouldn't even hold on to the fucking sword? Like, wow, good good going there, Virgin Games. Robin Hood unlocks the door with the door key. Really? Because I never thought of anything better to use the door key with! Who's this guy? I hope he's not having an orgasm too. Free me, and I'll show you the way out. Yeah, why should I trust you then, you knocker? Because if you don't, we are all dead. Well, uh, no. Then we shall die together. Well, oh, fuck you too then. Huh. Yeah, you kiss my ass. Huh. Wait a minute. Okay. Hmm. Uh, guess I can't talk to him anymore. Guess I shouldn't have said no. Maybe I'm gonna search around. Oh, I found the hidden door key. Hmm. Can I talk to him again? No. Uh, that was a zeme there, that Morgan Freeman character from the movie. And I guess he's not gonna help me or something, considering I said no to his ass. Oh boy, and this is all gonna fall apart. Prepare to die, infidel. Alright then, I'm gonna whoop you like Manchester United whopped a lot of other teams and might. Hey, I'm gonna whoop one of you like I'm lying on a table. And kids don't remember trying this at home wearing a mask there when they're not holding a five foot axe there. And this is basically the melee system right here. In hand combat, you're just trading buttons, string shots, smashing at each other. Kinda worse than Soul Calibur and Tekken combined. Okay, this is gonna be so bad in a hurry. Good thing I got a long sword. Why I'm holding it for that way, I have no idea. And he's dead! This is nothing like the Mega Man games, sir. Victory! Your foe is defeated. And why did his bones splatter all over the place? Free me and I'll show you the way out. Why should I trust you then? 
If you don't, uh, you know what I'm gonna say yes this time. Thank you, my friend. I am Azim. There is a secret passage under the floor at the southeast corner. I also hit a door key in the cell beside this one. I, I already found it, asshole! Azim has joined Robin's band. It's funny that he called me his friend after I said no to him earlier. Like, Robin Hood finds a hidden torch. Okay, like I could use that. Hmm. Okay, where's this hidden passage? You mean to tell me to find things I have to press search when I don't really need to? They should be out in the open. Like, come on. Oh, don't tell me I could not have seen that initially. We must move quickly. They will come after us. Yeah, at least they're completely attentive when they find out that a guy has escaped. Like, wow, holy shit! Like, the bad guys explode when you kill them? It's like, am I fighting Al-Qaeda or something in this? 1194 ID was the first known sighting of Al-Qaeda. And soon Osama Bin Laden came to be in 1200 AD. Oh, gray drab soldiers coming out of the woodworks. Like, they have so many people in the, uh, caves, but they don't have a lot of people in the actual jail cell. Maybe they should spend more of their budget on keeping swords attended to, like, weapon babysitters, perhaps? <laughs> like, okay, what was that I just picked up? Okay, player. Okay, so that's my inventory there. I'll take an apple, you know, inside the dark catacomb. I guess I have to put it to my mouth to eat it. Ah, I get 61 hit points. Uh, yeah. okay. Completely uninspiring inventory system. Uh, they couldn't just go and say use. Okay, you, you used it and you didn't help. I had to actually put it to my mouth as if Robin Hood didn't know what to do with an apple. Robin Retardation, Prince of Retards. What's my water wings? My I can't go start swinging in the Why am I these bad guys exploding? You know, the sword system reminds me of Zelda, except that he swings to the left when he's turning to the east, and s Whoa. Oh man, I just took a great chunk of damage there. And he swings to the right, if he's looking to the left. Apparently, Robin Hood is a switch hitter. Which is good, because switch hitters tend to be successful at baseball. It's too bad we're not playing fucking baseball. We're escaping from a prison. Like, why is Robin Hood just relying on a sword? Isn't he an archer or something? Like, he does not excel at melee combat. But this kind of reminds me of almost like the Metal Gear series. You saw a snake was holding a sword. And you're not relying on sneaking on enemies in this, because they pretty much see you. Kind of like a top head version of Wolfenstein 3D. It's completely uninspired graphics. I'm pretty sure the water in Jerusalem isn't blue. It's, but I guess they want to avoid as much brown shit as possible. You know, I found this review from a guy named The Spoony One, who did a review from his Spoony experiment. That's what actually got me inspired to look up video game reviews and Let's Plays in the first place. Alright, Band-Aids. What am I supposed to do with them? Okay, you can't eat the Band-Aids. Oh, wow, no shit. What am I supposed to do? Like, um... Use... You bandage your wounds. You bandage seven wounds! Go me! Yay! I'm taking out more exploding soldier terrorists. Wow, George Bush would be pleased. You know, I'm just gonna call a part of a Let's Play here. You know, I got a good idea. I think I might do this Let's Play and the Mega Man 6 Let's Play all at the same time so that I don't have to wait till I finish this one to do Mega Man 6. That way I'll keep a lot of people happy. So I hope you all enjoyed it. This is the Banga signing off saying goodbye and Godspeed.